There are four kinds of clouds. Cirrus, Stratus, Cumulus, and Cumulonimbus. Cirrus clouds are very high, thin clouds. They are so thin that you can see the sun or moon right through them. They can be more than five miles or eight kilometers above the ground. That's higher than where most airplanes fly. Cirrus clouds are gentle, soft, and feathery. They are not thick enough to make precipitation, so when you see them, you know that the weather is calm. Stratus clouds are lower clouds that are flat, stretched out, and gray. They can cover the whole sky and hide the sun. Stratus clouds can make rain or snow. Sometimes they stay for more than a day. If they stay for a long time, you might get a lot of rain or a lot of snow. They might also make very light rain called drizzle. In the winter, stratus clouds can make light snow called flurries. When they block the sun, stratus clouds keep you from getting warm. A special type of stratus cloud is fog. Fog is a cloud that is close to the ground. If you ever want to know what a cloud feels like, just go outside on a foggy day. You can't feel the cloud, but you will feel the moisture. It will make the air damp. Sometimes fog is only a few feet or a few meters thick. Other times it can be thousands of feet or thousands of meters thick and cause problems because drivers can't see very well and airplanes can't take off or land. Fog happens a lot in some places where you have water. Cumulus clouds are fluffy and puffy and they grow tall. They look like cotton balls as they bubble up into the air. Small cumulus clouds with lots of space in between them tell us the weather will be nice. The larger and taller cumulus clouds make rain showers or snow showers if it is cold enough. The showers usually don't last very long. When cumulus clouds make lightning, thunder, and heavy rain, they are called cumulonimbus. The cumulonimbus is the tallest cloud. Sometimes it can reach more than 10 miles or 16 kilometers high. It's the cloud that makes thunderstorms. When you see a cumulonimbus cloud, you have to make sure that you are safe from lightning and from the heavy rain. Cumulonimbus clouds can make a lot of rain in one spot to start a flood. Floods are dangerous to people. Floods also wash away soil and we call that erosion. You can do an experiment using sponges and a spray bottle to show that when the rain falls slowly, the ground is able to soak it up. But when it falls too fast, the ground can't hold all of it and it rises to make a flood. Always stay away from flood water.